Hi, I'm Chris, the Entertainment Man Bisco, and welcome to another edition of the Entertainment Man Talk Show. Alright, here we go. First of all, Happy New Year's. And Eric is off for New Year's today, so he is in here. Change of plans in the show uh, today. We were going to talk about Tobin Mori, but today we are not going to be talking about Tobin Mori. We're going to be talking about Fast New Year's. Like on New Year's, pretty much, and whatnot. The past New Year's, when I was younger, I started to um, pretty much. I. Uh, What's the word? Um, I was in bed by uh, midnight, pretty much. And, uh, yeah. So I was off. I was off to bed around New Year's. And as I got up to about maybe uh, 13 or 14, I started to stay up later and later and later. Now, uh, in the past years, we've had our neighbors over here um, for New Year's. We uh, stayed up until midnight, and I think the latest I was to bed was 1.35 in the morning, which is probably the latest I've been up on a New Year's ever. And uh, the years go on, they started, since the uh, General Motors Center was opened, they pretty much had the, um, they had the New Year's celebration festivities and all that there. And they, um, I've been going to it for the last, they opened in 2005, six, seven, eight, about well, three or four years now they've been there. And, um, that's what I, I go to it every year. This year, like, the New Year's Eve from 2000, New Year's Eve 2008 wasn't, too good because of the um, weather. The weather, not the weather. It was boring. The entertainment wasn't too good, and there wasn't much to see there and whatnot. It was boring, practically boring, at the time. So yeah, it was pretty boring. Last the last few years have been pretty good. This is probably the first year it's been pretty bad. It's been very boring, nothing going on. It's boring, boring, boring. It's not too good. It's terrible. It's not very good at all. It sucks. It. It was. It was. Just, I. Uh, we only lasted an hour this year. Uh, the New Year's Eve, 2008. We uh, lasted only an hour. Came back. I showered. I uh, came home, showered, went over the neighbors. That's how it's been the last few years. So last uh, New Year's Eve 2007, we didn't have New Year's over at the neighbors because they were down in Nebraska visiting their uh, son and their uh, daughter-in-law and uh, their their grandson. So now their grandson and their newborn uh, granddaughter was there in, over uh, here in Oshawa. So they. Um, Came up here for change for Christmas and New Year's and whatnot. Now, and we uh, when they went to bed, they were invited us over. And we had New Year's. We had little little uh, treats and all that. Some uh, Swedish meatballs, Italian meatballs, and we had some spring rolls, small little spring rolls. We also had some quiches and some uh, chicken or something or chicken something it was in a little pastry of some sort and then uh, in the past New Year's we've had last year 2007 uh, New Year's 2007 New Year's Day which is this they um, we I went to the Osha Generals game with my friend Eric my personal assistant who's not who's off today tonight I guess because it's uh, dark. Uh, we went to the Austria Generals game against Barry Colts and we won. Woohoo! And uh, whatnot. And it was fun. This year they're not playing today because 
we play tomorrow on the road so this year it's different uh, than uh, any other years they've done it in the past they've had uh, New Year's games pretty much every year and I think we're gonna take a quick break because we're probably a good way into the show tonight so we'll be right back after these uh, messages Hey, welcome back. And uh, just hang on a sec. Forgot. There we go. Okay, now welcome back. You're seeing a little bit of a glare. There we go. Get that out of the way. Alright, we're talking about New Year's. So. Yeah, I was talking about. The hockey game I went to last year, last New Year's, a year ago today. So yeah, that was the one I was doing. I was talking about, and yeah. So most New Year's Eve, I think the first New Year's Eve I ever had. Put my foot again up on my chair here. I get comfortable. Um, my first New Year's I ever. Whoops. I'm going to stay on my lap here. First New Year's I ever done was in 2000 when I got my clock. And so that's when I started the whole tradition tradition of staying up until uh, midnight on the thing completely and whatnot. What the? Oh. There you go. So... The whole thing up until midnight thing started um, in 2000. So I, it was uh, 1999, December 31st, 1999. That's when I uh, stayed up late, and I stayed up until midnight for New Year's, and yeah, and I after that I went to bed, and ever since I've been doing it for eight years now, and it's been pretty much a tradition. Last night I couldn't do it too long because I was tired. This year I started, well 2000 I did my first skate on New Year's Eve but ever since I had and I, it's the first time in about oh, thousand, I think seven, about nine years since I've uh, been on uh, uh, skates on New Year's Eve, beyond New Year's Eve but I have skates on New Year's Eve last year, 2008, so, yeah, and, um, what else I talked about, um, uh, so, I mean, um, yeah, 13 Legends, rank number two, and I was on, uh, for over an hour, and it was fun, it's tiring though, so by the end of the night, I was very, very tired, and I couldn't stay awake very long, up to um, uh, midnight, but I really pushed it, and I stayed up until midnight, and I made it, right up to the midnight. So, it was a lot of fun, and it's great, like, I got, I got this tradition going now, and I'm used to it, and staying up to midnight, and whatnot. Eric did it too, I know, because he texts me on my cell phone and I was not impressed with him at all I kind of told him I kind of give him heck and whatnot and I yeah I give him heck because he woke me up practically when I was going to bed around 12.50 I fell asleep in probably about, no well, 12.40 I went to bed so in 10 minutes I was asleep and I heard a buzz, buzz, buzz. I was, again, this. My cell phone went off once again. And it pretty much, it was, uh, 